Hey guys, Rob from MyPPCTraining.com and in today's video I'm going to run you through how to optimize your keyword bids on a 7 day, 14 day and 30 day basis to make sure your keywords are always winning and you're dropping the losers and decreasing bids on losers and scaling up the winners. Okay guys, so real simple. The, People try and complicate how to optimize your keyword bids and, and any kind of bidding type, really. It's not hard at all. All you're really going to do is go into the campaign you want to optimize, go to at least the last 30 days of data, go to the ad group level, you'll see here. Let's make this full screen for you. And what we're simply going to do is you're going to hit your conversion columns up here. And remember, if you don't know how to do that, you just come up here to your column tab, modify columns. Then you would add in which columns you want to see, hit apply. So real simple, we're going to come in here, we're going to sort cost per conversion. This client, we need the leads around 25, 30 bucks. So you can see they're pretty much almost there besides a few and a lot are way under. So we're going to work our way down from the top to, so we have two ad groups to work on because these are great. Nothing to worry about here. All right, so the first one, we go into it, sort by clicks so, so we can see what's going on. Okay, so this cost us $19, this keyword, and it had nine clicks and no leads at all. So we're pausing that. You can see I already did that. So that's a loser. So you pause that. This one had three and no leads. I just don't really think it's that great of a keyword, so I paused it. But you can, I mean, you could you de you could decrease bids. You, there's, there's a lot of things you can do with it, but I'm just going to cut it loose. I just don't, I don't even really care to deal with it. Then we got our one that converted here. Scrap trailers for sale. Two clicks, one lead. Four hour lead, 50% conversion rate, which is awesome. So I'm just, uh, you can see here we increased the bid on that one just a, a couple cents because the position was 2.1. So ideally, you want to have your position anywhere between 1.5 and 2.5. I found that's the sweet spot. So we're, we increased a little bit just to uh, see if we can grab some more impressions. But ideally, that's pretty good. So let's go back out to our ad groups. Go into ad group two that needs work. Sort by clicks. You can see here $36 per conversion, $34 per conversion, $67 per conversion. So remember, we want to be around $25, $30. So what we do is we started decreasing bids. And you can see the average bid was $297. That's what we were bidding. So I've already went through and did this, but we start dropping. So every seven days when you come through after, so you do one initial push for optimization. So you look at the last 30 days and then you start doing every seven days. You'll come through and do this and each week it'll compound and you'll start lowering your cost per lead slowly. So we, we usually just drop by 10 cents, 15 cents sometimes. So you can see here, that's what we did. And this one, because it was so high, we dropped it by a lot. So We'll check on that next week, but this is this is it, guys. This is really it. You just decrease your uh, your conversions that are costing you more than you like to pay, or you completely pause them if they're losers. See, so there's just not enough data. You have to pause these. Well, this one I paused because it's three, but that's just something I do. I don't recommend you guys do that. I just know this niche really well, so I know what's not gonna what's gonna work and what's not. But three three clicks is not enough to determine to pause something. So I'm like 10, 9, 10 clicks. It, if it's not converting, just cut it loose. There's no reason for it. So let's go back out to ad groups. And that's really it. I mean, go through all your ad groups, obviously, because there's going to be ones even in, the, even in the ad groups that are, con, are at your target CPL. You're going to find stuff that's converting high, and you're going to either pause that or, or decrease bids on it. So that's it for keyword bids. I mean, it really is that simple. I don't know why people try to overcomplicate it. Another thing we can do too is go under devices. You can look at your device bids and you can increase your conversion rate by messing with these. So let's see what's going on in our device bids. Okay, so we have 32 leads from desktop computers and 69 leads from phone. 9% conversion rate. So they're pretty they're pretty much really close in conversion rate. 
and then we got here tablet which is driving us leads that are almost double than mobile and desktop so what we're going to do ah what we're going to do is just drop that i'm going to drop it by 35 percent so we'll keep an eye on that and see what that does i'm going to remove the negative five percent And we'll check back on that next week. So let me know in the comments if you guys have any questions about keyword bids or if you do it a different way. I'd love to hear about it. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Give me a thumbs up on this video and check out the description for some cool links we dropped in there. Other than that, I'll catch you guys in the next video.